we're asked to find an eigenvector for the three by three matrix corresponding to lambda or the eigenvalue of two. The eigenvectors of matrix A corresponding to lambda are the non-zero solutions to the equation where we have the difference of matrix A, the given matrix, and the product of lambda and the identity matrix times vector x, where vector x is an eigenvector equals the zero vector. So let's begin by setting up the equation. Again, we have the given matrix A minus lambda, in our case lambda is two, times the three by three identity matrix times vector x, where again vector x is an eigenvector, equals the zero vector. Next, let's multiply the identity matrix by two, which gives us the following difference. And now we will subtract the two matrices. Notice how we're only subtracting two along the main diagonal. So now the main diagonal is negative 37, 33, negative five, all the other entries remain the same. I also wrote vector x as the vector x one, x two, x three, and the zero vector as the vector zero, zero, zero. From here, we will solve the system by writing an augmented matrix and writing the augmented matrix in reduced row echelon form. So here is the corresponding augmented matrix. Next, we write the augmented matrix in reduced row echelon form. Notice there is no pivot in column two which indicates x2 is a free variable. The first row indicates that x1 plus three x2 equals zero. The second row indicates x3 equals zero. And because x2 is a free variable, we state that x2 equals x2. Let's go ahead and parameterize the solution by letting the free variable of x2 equal t. So if x2 is equal to t, notice x1 is equal to negative three t, and x3 is still equal to zero. Now remember, an eigenvector can't be the zero vector, so we should make a note here that t can't equal zero. So all the eigenvectors x corresponding to lambda equals two are the vectors in the form of negative three t, t zero, which can be written as t times the vector negative three, one, zero. So this indicates all the eigenvectors corresponding to lambda equals two are all the scalar multiples of the vector negative three, one, zero, except the zero vector. This question is only asking for one eigenvector, and therefore we can select any scalar multiple of the vector negative three, one, zero, except the zero vector as the eigenvector. For example, if t is equal to one, we can just use the vector negative three, one, zero as an eigenvector of the matrix corresponding to lambda equals two. I hope you found this helpful.